In this video demonstration, we are going to operate a 1.5 horse, 220 volt, pentair water spot pump on two very different controls. The first demonstration is going to be pentair's pump with a single speed air switch control. The second demonstration will be pentair's pump with the new IES Extreme Variable Speed Controller. To prove our demonstration accuracy, we are using a 220 volt Variac power supply a digital watt meter, RPM gauge, digital flow meter, and a pitot tube flow meter for gallons per minute comparison. First we will demonstrate the single speed pump with air split. Checking the RPM. 3398. 1400 watts, gallons per minute is 139 on the digital flow meter and the same on the pitot tube This is a very straightforward operation for a single speed spa pump. Now we will move to the same pump configuration with the extreme tube variable speed control. I am now starting the Pantair spa pump with the IS controller. We are starting our demonstration at high speed to compare the numbers with the single speed pump. The 220 volt power supply is the same as before. Wattage is 1400 watts, same as the, same as the single speed pump. Gallons per minute have increased to 146, which is verified by the PO. Now let's take the RPM. The RPMs are at 33 feet. Next, I'll lower the speed. RPMs are at 3,000 gallons per minute, 130, and our watts have dropped 400 to 1,000 watts. Only losing 15 gallons per minute, we have dropped an amazing 400 watts. Let's drop the RPM down again. RPMs are at 1750 and we are at 300 watts. Gallons per minute is 75 and we have dropped 1100 watts. Now let's take it down to filtering speed. RPMs now are about 1,000, and as you can see, the pump is dramatically quieter. The watts are 133, gallons per minute is 38. In a spa, this would be our circulation speed for filtering and heating. We still have plenty of flow at 38 gallons per minute for great filtering. I'd like to point out the extremely cool operation. With the IS controller, you have low speed with low watts, and we all know the heat is in the use of watts. If you save watts, you save heat and power costs. The pump with the IS controller is now running at the cost of a 100 watt light bulb. Let's talk savings. A 100 watt pump running full time in a month is 731 hours, which is 73.1 kilowatt hours. The average kilowatt hour cost in the United States is 11 cents. That totals to a monthly spa filtering cost of just $8. Pentair Water True Variable Speed Controller will change the way spa factories design their spas. This unique pump controller allows a spa designer to use one pump to do massage and filtering, combination, spa filtering, massage and filtering combination, and use the built-in wave and plus features. 
or the designer can add as many pumps as they like to individualize the seating and massage experience. Multiple pumps can be scripted by the pack manufacturer to move and flow water in any way imaginable. We'd like to thank you for viewing this demonstration.